Okay, so we're joined by Ryan McCorville. Ryan, a good win on Sunday, but it's going to be, with all due respect, a more harder opposition on this Sunday coming. Ah, oh, I think Sunday was a was a great uh, bounce back from from the Glasgow City game. Um, preparations were good uh, during the week in regards to leading up to Hearts, and uh, we had a good Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, brought it into Sunday's game, and I think. Although Hearts were a very, very good side, played some good football, well structured, well organised, I think we took our chances on the day and uh, we deserved the three points, so that was pleasing. But going into this week's game, uh, myself and Kevin have have watched the footage of them of them play against Celtic. Very well organised, very well coached again. Uh, were very, very hard to break down, and Celtic had a lot of problems. So if a top side like Celtic has uh, problems breaking them down I don't see it going to be any different uh, for us on Sunday so uh, we know what we're going to expect and again it's it's one of those games that we need to try and get something from the game although being it away from home Is momentum a big thing this weekend? We have a we, we have a, a massive four weeks coming up uh, before Christmas we obviously have Spartans starting on Sunday and then we have Rangers Celtic Hibs uh, all of which are now top teams so we uh, we have to try and set goals uh, and try and set a certain amount of points that we're going to try and get for the, over the next four weeks because we don't want to be going into the Christmas break not picking any more points up from Hearts. So uh, I guess momentum is 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 a key word, uh, but I also think a wee bit of hunger, a wee bit of desire and, and, and show that we're still progressing and we still want to progress against the bigger sides. I think that's our ultimate goal going forward. We've known the next question, and it's kind of good that you've raised the point because we've been playing well. But is the standard in within yourself and Kevin knowing that you can play better, even though you've had a good start this season? Yeah, and we, and we weren't really finalised on our squad right up until the start of the league, you know. And we brought some players in on loan. We brought some players in who've who've come to stay with us permanently. We've had a few injuries in regards to Hannah Stewart and Leah Fleming, so. As I said, the transitional period of trying to figure out our best team, of trying to give players opportunities, different games uh, present different challenges, so different players suit those type of games. And again, Sunday won't be any different. There will be, be players that will be given an opportunity here on Sunday to prove their worth because it's a different type of a, of a game we're going to face. What type of game are you expecting from the Spartans on Sunday? A, a game which you'll respect your opponents, obviously. I think Debbie McCullough in our last uh, press interview called, classed her players as warriors, you know, and I think we're going into a big battle on Sunday. And my players, or our players at this club, have to really match that first and foremost. So before we even get onto the pitch, we need to be motivated, we need to be hungry, and we need to be able to match Spartans from, from 1 to 18 come Sunday. So I'm expecting a really difficult game. But one that I have every belief in my players that if we apply ourselves in the right manner, uh, I would like to try and get something from the game. Well, I thank you, Ryan. Thank you.